Good evening and welcome back once again. If you joined us last time, we had a convincing 3-1 win against Real Zaragoza and today we're back at home against Tenerife. Let's hope we can keep the winning streak continuing. And we've had a couple of enforced changes. We've continued with what we did in the last match, which is playing Carlos Perez up front with Bajero on the right. Arcas is actually coming back in on the left after he's been rested. We've had to drop Fabio Vieira just because he's on downward form. We're going to keep Herrera in even though he's looking a bit tired. We've actually have to take Xerxes not to even be on the bench. We've rested him hoping he'll be back in this match and he's on a, a downward form. So yeah, there's no way we can play him. But let's just jump into the match and see how we get on today. So yeah, this, you know, resting a, a few players, some of it hasn't paid off because, like I say, Xerxes was rested because, you know, to bring him back in for this match and um, he's just on that downward form, which is a shame. But Carlos Perez was man of the match in the last game playing up top. So let's hope that continues. Main thing is Vieira being out, actually. I could have played him. I don't really like to play anyone that's on any sort of downward condition or form um, unless it's really necessary <sighs> just couldn't quite get it from underneath my feet but again Carlos Perez could be dangerous in this game played really well in the last one got two goals And just in case you've missed any episodes, we have made the midfielder Herrera that we had on loan. We've actually made his signing permanent now. We did have an option to buy him. And we're just waiting for enough funds for the salary before we could do that. And we've we had that now. We've got a, a few hundred thousand left only, which is not a lot. So, yeah, but we've got him in, which is a good thing. was a fantastic ball. I don't know why no one got to it. Offside? No? Arrington! Oh, wide! He's in for Vieira today. Obviously wants to make an impact because he doesn't get many games even off the bench. He is a youth prospect, so he those tend to increase um, their skills of training a little bit quicker. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, we're not looking as solid in midfield as we normally do. Vieira has such an influence. Um, you know, him and for him and Herrera. I was going to say forever there. Him and Herrera have such a good partnership. Decent ball. Just a little bit too close to keep it, but not massively far off. Because it was uh, fired in. Nicely worked from Arcas there and Herrera. Oh, wonderful footwork by Perez. Gets the shot away, it's a decent save. Look at the footwork here just to get around the defender, slots it round, 
It's the only place you could aim for, really, with the two defenders. And... Yeah, okay, we'll go with him. Nice ball back out to Sanoon. That's a poor ball. Way too low. <clears throat> That's better. Oh, nearly. Just about defended. So we're just about a third of the way through the game, or just over. Still nil nil, but again, we've been on top. We are pretty much dominating the match. Oh, nice effort there. Nice idea, just a little bit weighty, but um, yeah, smart thinking. Nicely played from Herrera there. Harrington's got a bit of space. Harrington, ah. Oh. Straight keeper. Got to do better in that situation. Had a nice open field in front of him. I mean, yes, he got a shot on target, but it was an easy save. Lovely little ball through to Arcos there. And that's easily blocked. I know I complain about shots getting blocked, but that was just, yeah, straight at the defender. He's in again here, though. Carlos Perez. Oh, how's he hit it wide? Oh. I think that was genuinely harder to miss. I know that's a term that's used, but... Oh, that is harder to miss. <laughs> wow. I mean, that's without doubt the... Uh, by far the biggest chance of the half. Perez again though and again somehow his speed how is uh, that defender speed of past him there anyway it's half time nil nil not going to look at the stats because we've clearly dominated but let's jump in the second half just out of interest the possession was 58% to ourselves but we knew we had dominated that and we've had the you know all of the chances And gets it back oh, and then he loses it again good work from Herrera there nearly gets fouled Carlos Perez Carlos Perez and again it's blocked did well he's got um He's got good feet, Perez. Look at that. Cuts inside. Yeah. Herrera, good save. I think that might have uh, been bending. He is pretty sure. He hasn't been in the game too much. That's got to be a penalty. That is a penalty. He just got taken out. He did, didn't get the ball. How do I never get the free kicks? I don't understand. And when I do exactly the same thing, it gets given against me. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, nice ball through there. Gets taken out again. 
Oh, lovely goal. Bajer was just did so well on the right there. I think it was Harrington that got taken out. Yeah, he nicely plays it through. Got taken out. Bajer comes in, played on. Lovely finish from Arcas. Definitely should have had a penalty earlier, though. We're going to make some subs, I think. And I made the changes. I've decided I am actually going to bring Fabio Vieira on. I know he's on a bit of a down, but we're going to bring him on in place of Houghton. We're going to bring Herrera off in place of Castledean. And we're actually going to bring Mihailovic back on for Carlos Perez. Bear in mind, Mihailovic, the past two matches, he's come off the bench and he's scored in both games. Let's hope Mihailovic can keep that run continuing as the super sub. But remember, it's still only 1 0. Good tackle there. They win it back. Looking dangerous here. Good tackle from Hedge, though. Ah, oh, just over hit. That was a really good chance for a counter attack. But it's where we want it. We want it to be this end of the pitch. Good tackle. Was a foul, but we'll play on. Ah, it's offside. I wasn't actually trying to play it to Mihailovic there, I was trying to play it to, I think it was, um, Harrington? Kazaldin, whichever one it was. The one that brought on. Nice. Again, that's not who I was trying to pass to. Nicely played to Vieira. There's not a lot of space. Out to Arcas. Now Vieira. Oh, the inside of the post. Oh, very unlucky. I think if he wasn't on a downward condition, he would have slotted that in. Still a great effort. Here again, this time it's blocked. Just want to make sure we keep the ball as much as we can. Not time waste or anything like that, just being a little bit more conservative. Oh, good tackle there. Bit of a heavy touch. Wonderful tackle. <laughs> Bit rough, but uh nearly a nice little flick to Vieira by Mihailovic. Shares uh on his last legs at the moment. Vieira Mihailovic and he's done it again he truly is the super sub wow three games running but um, Vieira as well he gets an assist lovely one to slot it away hey I think we've got something in Mihailovic here Ball. Go 
wall need to keep this clean sheet. I wasn't sure what I was going to do there, that's why I lost it. Didn't make a decision. That's better. Poor pass from Vieira, it was really well worked and just the final ball. And uh, we'll definitely have Vieira take this. This will be the last attack. Can we get one last cross in? We can. Castledine, Vieira, Gyoza, Jet, Jet, oh just wide, oh that would have been a really lovely goal to get right at the uh, stroke of full time, really good win though, and we crept over that 60% possession mark. 13 shots with 7 on target and again nearly double the amount of passes. Ratings, Arcas actually got man of the match. He did score. Bjer put in a great performance. I think Perez deserved more than that. He played well. And Mihailovic getting another 7. That's 3 7s in a row from 3 substitute appearances with 3 goals. Brilliant stuff. And we're a little bit further ahead now. Looks like Levante lost and Laganas could only get a draw. So we're now 5 points clear. And that's it for this week, guys. The next match is against Alaves. We've had a week's break after that last match, which is good. So everyone should be fully fit. Let's just hope everyone's in good form. So join me for that one. Thanks for joining this week. And I'll see you all then. Cheers.